What's up DFS players, Alex here, and we are going through the best prize picks player props for today. So we've done pretty well recently in the MLB, but today we're switching it over to the WNBA. And the reason is WNBA player prop odds, um, they've been added to prize picks. So this is pretty cool because now you can compare the lines on prize picks to those on the sports books. So as a quick recap, right, the way that prize picks works is any two props you select, you're always going to be getting 20 to win 60. 20 to win 60. So that's just plus 200 odds. 20 to win 40 in profit plus your $20 stake back is just plus 200 odds. It doesn't matter if you take overs or unders. Prize Picks is a fixed payout platform. Any two props you select, overs, unders, you're gonna be getting plus 200 odds. So we've gone through the math before, but essentially what this means is for each player prop, prize picks is giving you an implied price of minus 137 odds, and you need to be hitting props at a rate of 57.74% to break even. So we're going to be going through the best props for today, and again, it's really exciting because a few other sports books like Bet365, Four Wins, North Star Bets, they all offer um, WNBA player props so we can compare the lines on prize picks to those on the sports books. I'll also make a plug. There's a link below in the description, but if you want to join the Odds Jam Discord, please feel free to. We give out, you know, some free picks daily. There's also a premium prize picks channel if you want all of our prize picks plays in real time right as we bet them with unit recommendations. You can join that. We're up 1450 so far and have only been doing it for a couple of days. So make sure to check that out. So anyways, if we get into the WNBA, we can see here, maybe this is an example of a mathematical, right, player prop we want to be on on prize picks. We have Tiffany Hayes over 14 and a half points, right? The implied price is minus 137 on prize picks. Now, if we take a look below, we can see every sports book is setting her line at over under 15 and a half. So this is a line discrepancy. Granted, it's not a massive line discrepancy, but this is an example of a player prop that maybe you'd want to go with the over on Tiffany Hayes, right? So if we go here to Tiffany Hayes, maybe you want to go with the over for Hayes today right? Tiffany Hayes over 14 and a half points. And then if you switch over, you know, to the, um, we can see this is in the Sun Liberty game. Jones under 14 and a half maybe is the bet you want to go on in the Sun Liberty game. Why? Because all the sports books are setting her line at over under 13 and a half. So this gives us an indication that, hey, prize picks is off from the rest of the market. So the under is the optimal bet, right? This may be the example of the bet you wanna go on, uh, go with on prize picks, right? So that's kind of an example of how you can use Odds Jam to find the best prize picks player props um, on a daily basis, right? You want to be comparing the lines on prize picks to those on the sports books, more efficient betting markets, and looking for inefficiencies. That's how we bet, that's how I bet right? I'm looking for mathematical edges. I'm not following some like, you know, whatever um, other really system. I'm obviously just looking at the math, looking at the numbers and trying to find these line discrepancies and scanning through the betting market on Odds Jam. So we have a WNBA basketball tab. So you can just go into any game, go to the market you want to bet on and take a look at the odds and browse for these line inefficiencies, right? So hopefully you found this video helpful. You know, maybe this is an example of a prop you want to lock in for today. Um, I have a few entries open and um, let's make some money.